the first floor of SHQ. We're now going to walk into the three original main rooms coming straight from the court from the stairs, going straight ahead on the original 1930s plan. This actually was a lecture room. Um, and you can see here the condition. We've done some work, basic cleaning here already. But you can see that the condition is not great. The piles of rubbish on the floor are ones we've already swept away. These are two blocked up windows already partly exposed because they were, would have uh, been exposed in the original layout of the building. And of course, there's lots of modifications post its original 1930s purpose. And we're still finding out more about what each room was used for in its, in its later life. So there's quite a lot of work to do to get this fantastic room into useful state. And most of that work is on this side where the front end of the main roof has leaked for many, many years and has therefore caused significant damage to the ceiling and the walls. So there'll be a fair bit of ceiling work to do, including replacing some of the wood for the plasterboard down this end as well. You can see a lot of the ceiling has been impacted. Again, so at some point over, they plastered over a very small hatchway that went through to a little room next door there. Uh, and then if we look at the windows, then you can see here the wood sill has gone. Um, the lower part of the wood has gone as well, as has the upright. So it's got a lot of work to do there. And the window's in pretty poor position. And the little bucket here is actually to catch some of the water that's still coming in. Even though we've done quite a bit of work on the roof, so they're not completely uh, secure. And those through both of the windows in here, uh, the windows have gone on, on the bottom 